17th, we actually spotted the Mon 1 well. Um, we drilled to a point uh, with a 21 inch bit to uh, 75 meters. Uh, we put a first stage casing in the ground and then four or five days later we went to the next stage of a 17 half inch hole. And put in the next size casing at 350 meters, which is uh, our second stage drilling and then on a week later we went to our third stage of hole and we went to 1150 meters pretty much and put in our, our 958 casing which is presently we're drilling through now. Our clay cap was encountered at 1100 meters so we uh, we went past it a little bit so we could put our in the uh, 1150 range so we can continue the geothermal work. The clay cap is uh, consisting of uh, well, mostly one type of clay called the selectite, which is uh, an insulator that's going to be above the reservoir and uh, uh, it's an impermeable layer that's going to keep the, the, the water below and it's going to heat up and the pressure is going to increase. It's, uh, it keeps the reservoir Fine. We through the first uh, 700 meters, we drilled some uh, volcanic rocks from uh, Supria Hill, uh, Central Hill, and Silver Peak, and then uh, we reached uh, the, the clays. Uh, below the clays, we now find some uh, silicified sandstone, which is a very crystalline rock, hard rock, in which uh, we expect to uh, find some uh, fracture uh, at uh, different locations. We. Based on uh, the few data we have, we, we, we should see them up at maybe in, in about 300 meters, around, around the 1500, but it can be as, as deep as 1800. Our present depth is at 1200 meters, but you know, at least we have to get through the steep zone and a little bit below it. So we're projecting between 18 and 2000 meters. Yeah, so Presently, we have protectors of guesstimate around 150, and we're projecting we get between two 250. The rates we've been going, it looks like it, it's taken about a week per phase, and so we're hoping to a week to end phase to get through this section.